Welcome back to Python Day 3 in our HackerRank 30 Days of Code Challenge. Today, we'll be going over intro to conditional statements. So our challenge is that we'll get an integer n, and we will have to perform the following conditional actions. So if n is odd, we print weird. If it's even, and in the range of 2 to 5, inclusive, not weird. 6 to 20, inclusive, weird. And if it's greater than 20, not weird. So for this, we can use if and else elif statements. And looking at the sample input, if we get 3, we print weird because it's odd. And if we get 24, we print not weird because it's even and greater than 20. So let's start to implement this. Firstly, the input we're getting is through the variable capital N. So we'll check if capital N is Odd. And to do that, we can use the remainder function or the modulus function. So if n modulus 2, so if it's divided by 2, and if the remainder is 1, then that means that it is an odd number. So we print weird. And if, let's say, n is even, so if capital N modulus 2 is even, so there would be no remainder. So if n is in the range of 2 to 6, because we need the inclusive range of 2 to 5, so if we do 2 to 6, it just cuts off 1 before, so it includes 2 to 5. So if it's in the, if it's in the inclusive range of 2 to 5, then we print not weird. And we can do the same thing for if it's in the range 6 to 20. So elif, uh, which means else if n in, is in the range 6 to 21, since we want to include 20, then we print weird. And if it's in the n, if n, so else if, else if n is greater than 20, then we print weird. So basically, we're using the if statement to check if it's uh, if it's odd, and then we're printing it odd if it's weird. And we're using another if statement to check if it's even. And so if it's in the range 2 to 5, then it prints not weird. Else, if it's in the range 6 to 20, it prints weird. And if it's greater than 20, not weird. So let's run our code and see. Okay, so it looks like we passed the sample case. Thank you for watching and see you in day four.